Nope, don't wipe my kisses off. I'll give me another one. Wait, wait. See, I don't see what I gotta deal with. Don't wipe them off. Keep my kisses. Wait, wait, wait. That's not nice. I like Give me a nose. Give me a nose. No, take your nose, take my nose, put it in the dog. So, take my, you know, put it in the dog. For mine back on. <laughs> You're crazy. I put your nose in the garbage. Not in the garbage. I need my nose. What you gotta say to the camera? Uh, Tell them subscribe. Say subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs> like, comment. Like, comment. Say all that good stuff. All that good stuff. <laughs> Come on, man. You ain't saying nothing. What's your name? Tell him your name. Uh, Maxwell. Alright. Alright. Show them something cool. <laughs> Legos Amelia. Let me see something cool again. Go ahead. Ooh! Damn! Yeah. Man, she's just asleep. She or he, babe? What is it? Come on. so Nah, let me stop. I still call my car she. She's been asleep for like ever, man. She ain't driving no more. She ain't going nowhere. She's just sitting at home. And it's a nice, beautiful, sunny day. But anyway, so today, I'm showing you guys how to pump gas in the Prius safely during the coronavirus. Alright? So we're going to go ahead and Get this, get this thing filled up, man. I'm gonna see how much it takes in gas. I drove about almost 500 miles in it. So let's see how much gas it's gonna take. But anyway, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to the channel right now, make sure you hit that. My wife is gonna start up a car interrupting. Hit that subscribe button right now if you're, if you're new to the channel. So we're gonna go ahead and get some gas and um, get back with you guys. All right, so as you guys see, I'm in the car right now. Like I was saying before I had to put the trash can inside, if you're new to the channel, make sure you like, subscribe, comment, hit that subscribe button right now and that corner over there. And um, just follow the channel, man. Show some love, you know what I mean? Show some support. So I'm just cruising through the neighborhood right now. We're gonna get gas in both cars. Cause I don't want I don't like going to the gas station multiple times right now. Like if I need gas, I'm filling her car one time. Like, might as well get it out the way. That way. I'm doing my, my fueling procedure one time, not twice. So I wanna just get gas one time, and that's that. And right now, I've been getting gas every six days in the Prius. So far, it's been doing like amazing on gas. But yeah, I got a new stop sign in my neighborhood. Shit, right. They just planted this last night on me. Oh, shit. So this was never there. And they put another one over there on the other side. So they wanted to make sure like, yo, everyone's stopping, I guess. I don't know that. Intersection must be on. Um, Sorry, let me get that camera back. Yeah, that intersection must be kind of crazy for some reason. So they must have decided to put stop signs. But yeah. So yeah, I, I've been driving like six days straight. Back and forth to, um, you know, to Orlando itself. I live outside of Orlando. And yo, this thing has been doing wonderful on gas. Averaging like 48 miles per gallon. I can't complain, man. I mean, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't the, the sportiest car. It ain't the fastest car, but it's doing what I it's doing what I bought it for. What what I bought it to do is doing its job. You know what I mean? Taking me to work and back for like minimal cost, and you know what I mean? Is dependable as heck. And you already know Toyota, man. Toyota is, is a win. Can't go wrong. But um, so I did fill it one time last week, and it took. Like 18, no, I think it was $19 it took to fill up. So we'll see. I think I got more gas now than I did last week also. So it's probably going to take a little bit less than $19 this time. But yo, guys, you guys going to see, I got another car that I bought. So I'm going to show you guys that car when we get to the gas station. Stay tuned. So my wife is extremely happy with this buy. It was for her, it wasn't for me. So... Yeah, we got another car. I'm gonna show you guys that in a minute. 
All right, so I'll tell you guys, I was gonna show you this car when we get to the gas station. We didn't make it to the gas station because the gas station was hella packed. So we'll just go somewhere else in a little bit. But we do gotta go to Walmart, so. But anyway, this is the new car that I bought right here. So I did get rid of my Durango. All the Mopar lovers are gonna hate me right now, but I did get rid of the Durango. She doesn't really benefit really in honestly having a Durango, man. She doesn't really use the, the damn, I think something's on my lens. But anyway, she doesn't really use the third row at all. So we got her 2020 Camry. There she goes. Look at the interior. The bloody interior. Bleeding out. Yeah, so. We want to look more at this car another time, man. But that's it right here. 2020 Camry. I think it's dope. I gotta check my lens. My lens is dirty again. Alright, guys. So during the coronavirus, we'll make sure we don't want to look at the car. Swipe with one hand. So swipe with this hand. So you're not touching that. Then you get your glove on. Okay? Put your glove on one hand. All you need is one glove. Put it in your pen. You just gave the internet our pen. <laughs> they didn't see that. Alright, so that's it. So I can touch my side of the car right here. I'm touching. This is clean. This is me. You gotta take the gas cap off like normal. So you wanna just put a pump itself if you wanna handle it. Let's see what this Prius takes right now. Come on, baby, get, get that numbers up. Callie's recording, FYI, guys. Say hi to them. Oh, hi, guys. They wanna see you, maybe. I thought they wanted to see the gas pump. No, they, 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 could, they could see that afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to. Show them your new car. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you might as well talk about it in the car. How you like it so far? I love it. Look how cute it is. You messy Durango? No. Alright. <laughs> Look how cute. I mean, a little minty over here is cuter, but... Oh, well, let's switch cars then. Look. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's it. Look at that. Five days of driving in the Prius back and forth to Orlando. Took 1281. So we're gonna try and squeeze some in there. Let's see. Man, it only ain't taking much more. Uh, whatever. We'll leave it at 1325, alright? We call it 1325. Can I go wrong? Hell nah. Alright, so we're gonna put the camera down because uh Callie needs to pull her cop. I love the front of this thing. The front of this thing is nasty, yo. Yo, open the um, open the gas cap. Kelly's taking her damn time. Hold the hold the button that says the, for the fuel door button. Hold it down. There you go. She got it. <laughs> So we're gonna have her just swipe and then I'll do everything else. So you swipe. How long you been driving this car now? For a week? Yeah. So she's been driving for a week now also. Just put it in, I got everything else. So. Let's see. I'm gonna have to drink right now. I didn't even know that shit sit there. Well, I, I was trying to get it in there with one hand, with the other hand, but it couldn't. So anyway, you've been driving for a week. You got a half tank? Yep. Let's see what this thing a takes. A little over half. A little bit over half. So, that was my issue with the Durango, honestly, guys. Like, yo, she didn't, she just did a lot of sitting. She don't really drive far. So it's important us to like, really and truly have a gas guzzler that she's not really using. She doesn't use the seven seats. So it was kind of pointless. So, you know, she decided she wanted something new. She had her eyes on the camera for a very long time, so we decided to go that route. Here it is. Well, you know, we couldn't, we couldn't just be basic and get a black interior. Cali with a red interior. <laughs> well, I was gonna get the gray interior, but the car was scratched. Yeah, the car was scratched, yeah. Man, look at that. So, Cali's driving for a week. 
She has never sold them, you know, that amount before ever. Just top it off. Whatever. Let's cut it off. $60 a week to the not even using a whole tank. Can't go wrong, right? That's it. Throw the glove away. That's how you feel, man. Want some of my hand sanitizer? Sure. All right, let me get some of that and we out of here. All right, so that's how you feel, man. You know what I'm saying? With using one glove. And make sure you guys are sanitizing before and after. You know what I'm saying? So I sanitized before. Well, I had washed my hands first. Still sanitized before. Use the glove with one hand. Like I said, the only thing I'm touching is the card and my fuel door itself, pretty much, and my gas cap with this hand. This hand right here is what's going to be touching the pump. Everything that's pretty much dirty that the general public is using. So just want to make sure you're staying clean out there, man. Try not to touch your face, stuff like that, man. Just. You know what I mean? Let's just try and keep it clean, man, and stay healthy out here, guys. So, um, hope everyone's having, you know, a good day. And it's being, you know, safe through this whole coronavirus crap, man. And we're gonna all make through it, man. And you know what I'm saying? We'll be good to go. So, so stay safe. You know what I mean? Take care of your loved ones. Make sure you take care of your kids. Make sure they stay safe. Yeah, you know, the elderly, of course. Don't be visiting your parents too much. You know what I mean? Cause you don't know if you're carrying it. You might not show no symptoms. So if you visit your parents, you just don't know. You could pass it on to them and not even know. So like right now, really and truly, we, I just made mainly talk to my mom on the phone. And as soon as this thing kind of calms down, I'll go ahead and start back visiting. But unfortunately, right now, it's not even doesn't make sense visiting your parents at all. Like it's sad, but it's true. So you know what do you got to do? FaceTime, Skype, whatever you might have to do to you know video chat them. Or if you know you got to drop something off. Drop it at the door or whatever. Just try not to be all up in their face, man. So, like I said, guys, stay safe, stay clean. Catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.